Hello and welcome back to another video with me, Cookie Swirl C. Today, we're gonna be checking out my whole entire nail polish collection. Yes, I have a lot of nail polish. I love nail polish, because I did a lot, a lot, a lot of videos and I always had really bright, beautiful nails. And who doesn't love nail polish? As you can see, I have a bunch of nail polish. A lot of these I've had for many, many years, longer than I've even had my YouTube channel. So older than 2013 nail polish here. So some of this stuff needs to be decluttered. So you can see I have this whole rack right here of all of my favorite polishes. I've got this bin full of glitters and this other bin right here of just kind of overflow polishes. So here we go, come along with me. We're gonna do a declutter. All right, we all know what expired nail polish looks like, right? It's gonna be discolored, gloopy, thick, separated, has a really strong chemical smell. So that's what I'm looking for when I declutter. All right, let's get started with all of my glitter polishes. So I'm gonna do a quick little swatch to see how the polishes still perform. And if they're bad, they gotta go. Like this one right here. Look at how separated that is. That is a lot of separation in that polish, as beautiful as it is. So let's give it a shake, see if I can get it to mix. Okay, that actually looks pretty good. And swatching, oh yeah, it's still beautiful. Okay, we're gonna keep this one. This one's beautiful. Okay, we're gonna keep that one. That one still looks really good. I think this one's kind of fairly new in my collection too. Okay, this one looks kinda good but look at the back. Look at how discolored that is. Oh, you guys, it's really chunky in there. Oh, that one is pretty chunky. I wonder how this one's gonna swatch. So let me try to mix it. Actually mix pretty nicely. And oh no, it's perfect. Oh, that's like the perfect pink. Okay, this one's perfect, gorgeous glitter. Might be a little dry. Okay, that one actually looks almost unswatchable because of how sticky it looks. Yeah, look at that. Nothing to even swatch, which I'm sure there is a way to revive some of your old polishes that have kind of dried out, but I think it's just time for it to go to nail polish heaven. Goodbye. This one I used to wear all the time. This one looks like it's really discolored. It used to be clear and now it's really yellow. And you can see how much I've used it and loved it. Yeah, look at that. Look at how sticky it is now. Mm -mm. That one's definitely gone bad. Okay, here's another one. Another one I used to wear all the time, but it does look a little bit on the sticky side. Oh, it's still really pretty though. Okay, I think it's fine. Another one that's really discolored, really liquidy at the bottom of the skull. Ew, that even sounds gross just saying that. Okay, even mixed up, it still looks really, really murky. Yeah, I'm gonna let this one go. Even though the glitters are still there, the fact that it has that yellow discoloration in the back, I think it expired. Ooh, here's a pretty one. Very red, white, and blue, but very, very separated too. Let's see, nope, still pretty. Here's another one I used to use all the time. It kind of looks like a cake pop. Still swatches nice. This one is really separated at the top. All that glitter is now at the bottom. Okay, we're keeping it. Another one of my favorites. This used to be like my go-to glitter topper. Ugh, okay, good. It still swatches great. Come on, look at that. Is that just glitter heaven? Yeah, it is. Oh, I used to love these little bonbons. Ooh, okay, this one does not look too good in there though. Okay, it swatches, but that clear base behind it has really discolored, so I'm gonna declutter this one. Woo, what happened here? Okay, you don't get much glitter payoff in this one, but I'll keep it. Oh, another one that I love, you guys. I love this one. Okay, good, that one still swatches perfectly. So happy. Look how beautiful this one is. This one's called Vampire's Blood. Ooh. So vampires have a dark, almost black base blood with hot pink glitter. This one's Ruby Pumps. Still looks pretty good. Okay, the brush looks a little crusty, but look how nice that swatch is. That almost looks like vampire blood too, right? With a red base. Shake this one up. That still looks really, really good. That looks really good still. Yes. Okay, it discolored a little bit in the clear base, but I'm still keeping it. That is so much glitter and just that tiny little swatch. I love it. Oh, how many of my OG fans that have been watching me from the start remember this one? I used to have these like iridescent flakies also on my nails all the time. Okay, it doesn't even mix and shake up. I've used it so much. Let's see what happens whenever I open it. Oh uh, no, it looks a little dry. Yeah, it's really dry. Oh, I don't wanna get rid of this one. You know, I'm gonna somehow make it work. This one's a little separated there on the top. Hmm. Perfect. How cute is this one? This one actually has little pink hearts on the inside, but it looks like it's really separated. Just giving it a shake, they didn't really mix. Not a good sign. But it looks like I can still gather and place those hearts. 
so I'm gonna keep this one. I don't think the same can be said for this one. This is a cute little LOL polish that I probably made in a kit. It looks like it's already dried out. It can't even pick up any of those hearts. Here's another cute LOL one. That looks really dried out and crusty too. Oh, we even just the lid just came off. That's how dried out this one is. Ugh, this one doesn't look very good either. Wait, but it mixed up very nicely. Oh no, same thing with this one. The brush became unglued from the cap, oh, but it swatches perfectly still and that base is still clear along with the glitter. Look how much I used this one too. Oh yeah, that is completely dried out. There's not even anything to swatch. Fly away to nail polish heaven. This will be interesting to swatch too. Oh, no, no, it's all dry, crusty, no. Here's another pure gold glitter. Let's see, oh, that one's really pretty. Okay, that one you can tell is not expired compared to this other one because this one still has a clear base. This one's discolored just a little bit, but I love this one. It has moons, stars, and diamonds on the inside that are holographic. Okay, I'm still keeping this one. This one, oh good, this one's still good too. I don't know about this one. Oh, actually it looks really good. Oh, but it has a really, really strong chemical smell. Ooh, zombie zest. Still murky and swampy. Okay, just looking at some of these polishes right here, I can still see that some are still really good. Like this one right here, that one is still really fresh, really nice. So I'm just gonna pull out the ones that are really discolored that look like they might've expired, like this one. Yeah, it's really discolored right here on the bottle. This the swatch is still nice though. Oh, this one looks like a chopped up candy cane. This over a white polish is just perfection. This silver looks a little bit thick, a little gloopy. All right, it all comes down to the swatch. No, that was pretty smooth and the base is still clear. Here's another favorite that I used to use all the time. This one's called Sweet Tooth. Uh, okay, yeah, I'm not surprised. It's completely dried out. I mean, I really use that one. How cute are these ones? They look like little ice cream cones. Yeah, they swatch like ice cream too. It's very sticky. This one's supposed to be the purple one, but it has almost no color. Oh, here's another declutter, very chunky. Glitter's pretty though. So here's a cute little Beauty and the Beast one with Belle on it. I like the cupcake, but the polish is just too chunky and dried out. It's like actually stuck. Okay, that was really dry. Oh, I love this one. No, but look at how gloopy it is. Oh, I wish I could save this one because the, the hollow glitter in it is just perfect, but it's too dried out, too clumpy. Here's another glitter I used to use all the time. Uh, looks, it looks pretty dried out and like really sticky. Uh, actually it swatches okay though. This one looks like blackberry ice cream to me. Oh yes, another absolute favorite. Yeah, it's not gonna make it, it's way too dry. Nothing to swatch really. Here's another cute little LOL DIY one. Ooh, oh, the lid. And all the hearts on the inside, it, it looks all dried up anyways. Ooh, this doesn't look good. All right, what do we have, what do we have? Yeah, that looks quite chunky. Only the swatch can tell, so let's see. Ugh, yeah, it just looks really muddy. I think that base has discolored. It almost looks gray. As much as I loved wearing these ice cream kind of ones, cause they had like that milky base, they used to chip really easily. See how it swatches? No, it swatches really good though. This one looks really pretty, but it might be really discolored and it's looking a little bit sticky. Oh no, what a surprise, it's still good. Yes, another glitter polish that I love. Another favorite, this one's kind of like a ice cream, strawberry ice cream glitter, but it's looking dry. Yeah, I can't give that great of a swatch. Off to makeup heaven. Another little LOL one that you can see just how dry it looks on the inside. It kind of looks like sand. Oh, and the top came off too. Another one I used to use all the time. Look at that, I used it up quite a bit. It's only a little bit left at the bottom. Oh, it's all dried out. That's really, really dried out. Yeah. It's just making a sticky mess now, but definitely one of my favorites with that holographic, almost kind of pastel type of glitter in there. But no worries, I have a double, so I don't have to be without this polish. Now coming down to the end of the glitter polishes, I've got these ones. Ew, this one doesn't look so good. As beautiful as this one is, I can't even get it open. The cap is like sealed on. <laughs> I guess it doesn't want me to check and see if it's expired or not. It's really pretty though. It's called Lubu Heels, like a dark base with really beautiful red glitter. Oh, I used to wear this one for Halloween all the time. Look at that though, really discolored. Ah, uh, a little sticky. Oh, and a lot of chunky. Oh, this one's one of my favorite Halloween ones. 
Okay, gotta say goodbye to it. It's just not a smooth polish anymore. It's just too chunky. I also had these nail polishes as part of my glitter section because they come with a little tube of glitter right at the bottom of the polish. The nail polish doesn't look so good in there. Wait, wait, actually, it doesn't look too bad. Well, I don't know, maybe that is kind of sticky. Oh yeah, it's actually really sticky. That's not a smooth polish to paint with at all. But I'm still gonna hang on to these because I love the glitter that they actually come with, so. We'll definitely keep those. Here are a bunch of new glitters that I just added to my collection. These are all brand new. You guys know I just reviewed this Jurassic World set. So these Jurassic ones are really fresh because I just bought them. I have this beautiful one. It looks like a Christmas tree. These beautiful rainbow glitter ones and a brand new hologram one. Ha, ah, holographic glitter, how I love you. Now I might have some glitters hiding on these rows right here. I tried to always keep them separate. Oh wait, I think I see one. This one right here. Oh, and mint chocolate chip, is that you? So let's see if these are still good. Okay, this one has a really strong chemical scent. Seems to swatch really nicely though. And come on, don't tell me that this one does not remind you of mint chip ice cream. Don't eat it though. Let's see, yep, still looks good to me. There we go, so those are all of my glitter polishes now that I've decluttered the really, really old ones. There's probably some other ones in here I probably should have let go of, but I just love nail polish. So join me in part two and I can go over the rest of my nail polish collection. I hope you are just as happy, sparkly, and glittery as this nail polish right here. Come on, look at that. It's got happy faces right in the glitter. Be beautiful, be amazing, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye you guys.